From the halls of Miller College of the Bible in Pamberin to the stage of the Players Theater in Manhattan, the Saskatchewan-based ensemble took their theatrical talents and dreams of stardom to this off-Broadway stage. Thanks to director Kathy Covert's connections in the industry, the cast of Drum Beats was chosen to perform on stage for three consecutive nights, including two sold-out shows. An experience of a lifetime for these cast members. The first time was quite nerve-wracking. We were a little nervous backstage, but um, afterwards, once we were on stage, we were having a blast. We actually got to have the president of the mission that sent the missionary in our own story. Uh, he came and watched our show, and that was amazing to meet him, and it kind of brought the story to life. Second-year Miller student Michael Bergen played the lead role of missionary L.J. Ruskin and goes into more detail about the production storyline. Well, Drum Beats is uh, a drama based around uh, rhythm and uh, dance. So it's, uh, it's based around a missionary named Algy Ruskin, and he goes uh, into the Congo and just aims to love the people and learn about their culture and just, uh, and just share his life with them and, and let them share their life with, with him. Cast member Caleb Dreger was one of the many on stage playing percussion and living out his lifelong enjoyment of the arts, bringing back fond memories of the New York experience. I have a big love for music and I definitely love to get into that and um, if that ever took me back to New York I would I would definitely go and uh, and I love drama as well so I mean they mixed together and it was perfect for me and uh, I'd love to head back there someday maybe. The production of Drum Beats was choreographed and performed specifically for the Players Theatre performance in Manhattan. However Southwest residents will have one final chance to see the production tonight at Miller College. Miller College of the Bible is located in Pambrin, approximately 45 minutes southeast of Swift Current.